Howdy folks, it is Lanso Knight here, and welcome back to our challenge run with Orange 01, where we're trying to get uh, as many kills as we can in 24 hours. Unfortunately, my time has come, I think. Oh man, there's a fast grave like right down the road, that's crazy. That figures. Um, We got a ton of kills on the upstairs, and then when we got to the downstairs, everything fell apart. I started playing pretty sloppy. So, we're trapped in a little farmhouse that doesn't have anything in it. <laughs> and there's nowhere else to go, really. Maybe I could clear out, like, one house. I doubt it, though. Not in this condition. So, what's my plan now? I need to get as many kills as possible, and I got a few kills I can get out of this gun, right? There's not a whole lot more we can do to patch up. Head, left arm, right arm, left leg. I could still bandage my right leg. I could still bandage my right... Oh. I guess my hands I could bandage. They're not, they're not damaged, though. Hmm. We're just trying to see. Moderately hypovolemic. I can't scroll over it to see what that means. Early anemia. It's a large amount of blood and you're not feeling too good. Yeah, can't imagine why. Arms are cold. Something must have broke. No, I still have a hard arm. I don't know why we started getting, taking so much damage, to be honest with you. Well... I'd say let's just start playing it as if it's the normal game. Although my guy is mentally handicapped now, so <laughs> I don't think he can make anything. And he also didn't have any skills, so I don't think he can make like a wooden needle. No. Make a billet, apparently. I can do cudgel, I need one anyway. My vision got worse. I guess it's just uh, the headlamp's done. <laughs> what kind of clothing can we make? Can we make something to warm up our arms? Paper arm guards. Paper. I actually can do that. Because there's books here. really carry anything though. Dude. Drop all those. That butter knife's not gonna cut anything anytime soon. So everything once, put it down, start working. Arm guards. Five warmth. <laughs> it's something, I guess. Very thirsty. Did I puke? I must have vomed, right? Feel feeble. A gust of wind could knock you over. Guess we're gonna have to process some water then. We got a glass jar of ghee. Could dump that out and go get water. Load. Bloop. Oh, the toilet's empty. That's not common. Oh, man, it's gonna make me walk into. It's gonna make me walk into the forest to go get water. Oh, the forests have water, right? Yeah. Well, this is no forest, is it? 
This is just yard. There's the puddle. <laughs> I didn't want to walk to the swamp. This is very little water, but that's all we've got. sense whatsoever because my strength is like two now <laughs> not enough capacity for a splintered wood that makes no sense Jesse what the F are you talking about Bro, what's happening to you? <laughs> I don't know what the heck is going on to him. Yeah, uh, we stopped the bleeding. I don't know why he's getting worse. blanket or anything. I guess I could bash a window and get a sheet, huh? That's not what I wanted to do. Guess this window is the safest one to knock out, really. All things considered. Well, I can see if sleeping will help him out. Probably not. He's probably just going to die. Uh, we should have more than 52 kills. We should check. 53. No alarm. <laughs> so you're trying to fall asleep. Wake up. We're alive and a little bit better than we were. Okay, so let's smash more of this. Okay. Star and plastic bottle. <laughs> We only have till 8 a.m., so there's 10 hours left in our game here. Whether or not I can get this guy back on his feet enough to uh, make it. You know what? We don't have any music on. I apologize for that. Start a glass jar. Whether or not I can get him back on his feet in that amount of time, I don't know. Probably not. What the heck? Why can't you make water right now, bud? What? How did we have a tool with boiling or more before? 
something in here that we can't see? Put the soy sauce in my inventory. There we go. wrong with you this is really weird I've never seen that before <laughs> does he do they have the zombie books he should be cured I cauterized the wounds I don't know what happened it's probably that he's dehydrated but more obsessed with uh, dying from smoke inhalation even though there's no smoke nearby I don't know how else you're supposed to work on cooking if uh, that happens but who am I to judge I stop actually I meant to no To do a batch there. It's like thin smoke everywhere. Very strange. Do I need to like open this window? Well, <laughs> bit of a problem with that is, uh, Can't really be done. I can do that. <laughs> Character is uh, not long for this world at all. Clean water, batch of two. Is he just like vomiting it all up? I don't know why he's still thirsty. <laughs> you should say in the sidebar if he's not. Oh, you guys can't see the sidebar. It's not in the sidebar though. Gonna have to trust me on that one. Boop. You can see for yourself that he's not puking. He's just, uh,. Not getting satiated. I wish I had a gallon jug right now. Going to town on this water, man. It's a bit of a slow process. Yeah, just go out the window. It's faster. Faster for me, not faster for him. Come on. Live, damn you, live. There we go. It's finally hydrated. Oh, boy. Ooh, I have, like, a entertainment book here for him to read. Our head is born. Drop the... 
bike helmet. Out the storm. Drop the net scarf. <laughs> it requires the intelligence of five to use Lily. Well, I have our intelligence of five now. Tired and you breathe heavily. No longer in shock. And you're thirsty again. Not a lot of time left. Hey, we have our we have our normal stats back actually. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> we are we're no longer the walking dead. I'll type over Lee McShock. We're still happy though. After everything else, we're still happy. Fire is lasting a long time this time. I don't know why. Better part of a day. It's extremely well supplied. Without extra fuel, it might burn for. Huh. Normally, I'm just like tossing planks in here constantly. I don't know why it's saying it's going to last so long. Is because there's like nails and stuff in there? That'd be weird. Never heard of that before, but. Yeah. Players being wasted. Activate P3 player. So with our stats back to normal, we can honestly probably do some fighting. Fighting. as good as it's gonna get mate so wield our cudgel get some rings only want the rags here uh that's everything maybe they're close enough to use now though <laughs> and the wooden needle now, it figures. And the washboard and everything. Too late. Bear. Need that. Do you need those? Be player. Oh, we have a. Uh, a wristwatch, so I actually don't need the cell phone, which is good. Switchblade. That was a great item, but not necessary right now. Okay. We go and try to build a wooden needle just to try to repair what we've got. I don't know if I ever made it out with thread, though. I did, actually. Reload with needle with thread. Can't spend too much time on these. <laughs> Lamp, battery. Load 
ahead right now with the big battery. Duct tape, antibiotics. It's about as good as it gets. All right. So. We have options now, honestly. We can fight these mass grave zombies. I could try to get back to the resort. Kill the zombies there the good old fashioned way. The thing that's interesting here is we do have a fence. That's a wire fence, which actually caused problems for these zombies out here. Let's wait my head like. Fortunately, makes it so they can see me from farther than I can see them. Still got hit, man. <laughs> he still got hit. Surprised our bashing weapon skill is not higher, to be honest with you. Shocked that it's not higher. There's a mass grave over there. Get myself in big trouble by messing with a mass grave. There's the pond. Oh, these sleeling seedlings are rough terrain. Feral. Yeah, I don't really want to fuck with feral human. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like I'm gonna get a choice. I'm trying to get them separated so we can fight them separately. Stop throwing rocks and get on the fence. Squish sun. A lot of zombies. However, oh, this feral human. Yeah, his clothes are wearable, which is very nice. Uh, for a while, that's what I was looking for. How does that compare to what I've got? Very slightly higher damage, but that's about it. Really want to fight this many zombies at the same time. Activate our headlamp. Zombies. Zombies, man. Catch our breath, please. Hmm. It's again in pain. Would have been nice to have found a little bit of aspirin. It's usually. Really easy to find, Aspen. 
but not today apparently. Not there. Just thinking we can kind of like uh, Kevin McAllister this house and just uh, into a series of uh, doorways that I can funnel them into. kills as we can before our time runs out. What the frick? Got a huge old axe. Good throw, bro. Get dusted. Ooh, hoo, hoo, a fire axe. Hold up. That might change things. The fire axe is some good. Good AS. Good AS. Uh, my heart chest arm is, armor is very sick, by the way. Fire axe. 14 damage a swing. That's what we need. We need new armor, though. Leather duster. I might do it. Drop. Heart chest guard. Wear. Leather duster. Ooh, there's a bunch of zombies out here. <laughs> I, uh, I don't think there's any zombies out there. What the heck? Oh, it's beautiful. Please, I know you're trying to bash that door down, but it's not necessary. You've got to... Oh, man, if we had this a long time ago, think of how many kills we could have had. Rice game. <laughs> kind of bandage everything up. If you need a tutorial series, I recommend watching the tutorial series and not this, because uh, this ain't how you're supposed to play the game. Not one bit. I'm just doing this to get as many kills as I possibly can. You know what? We don't have our MP3 player on. Guy needs to kill or play, listen to win, live to win while he's uh, grinding zombies. Of this fire axe. Man, if we had to have the fire axe at the start of the game. <laughs> oh, the places we could have gone. Uh, 
Uh, what is that? Dandelion. Okay, it looked like a floating brain or something. I'm going to activate my flashlight. Wrong one. I figured he probably couldn't throw anything with the, uh, the lights off. We're here, John B. Child. Waters. Oh my god. <laughs> that damage is incredible. Did this guy drop anything, by the way? Earless gloves. flag <laughs> platinum ring all right I like to do I wish we could get some painkillers painkillers will go a long way actually making some progress you know I'll try clearing out houses instead of the you know, that'd probably be better. We got, oops, god damn it. Turn off the wrong thing. Normally anything that's on is highlighted in yellow, but I guess if it's a filthy item, it still like, stays brown. Keep safe mode on while we're running down this. I think it'll be easier to clear out the town than working on the, uh, the place. Where are you? Spiders! Spiders, spiders, spiders. By the way, we should probably take a quick look. 70 monsters killed. Not sure why you're so far away from home, my good sir. There be light. Chop, chop. Get out of here, brainless zombie. Yeah, I should be able to, like... Take off one zombie at a time a lot easier by fighting him this way. Rather than, uh, it's going for the dogs, I guess. Might be enough dogs for it to just die. I don't want to get in a fight with the dogs, though. Dogs turn aggressive once they've been attacked. Whatever. Zombie child. Still trying to make use of like, oh shoot, here comes a dog now. Yep. What the? Get it. <laughs> yeah. Keep it zombie dogs. Actually, they're just regular dogs. They just got angered by this zombie. They did kill the zombie, though. Get into some buildings, bathrooms. We can get into some bathrooms. We might be able to find some medicine. We just need painkillers to force our guy to continue. <laughs> Oh, 
the parasitic drug. Aspirin, it's a start. We need like a tramadol or something here, but. Use of, like anything here. I want to go downstairs, but here we go. What the heck what kind of basement is this? What the heck? If I run, I might be able to get to that. Yeah. Is this impassable? Oh. That doesn't really help me, though. It's all in pass. Dang it. Impassable sounds like it'd be good, because you don't want zombies to get through. But no. That's not what I'm trying to do. What are you doing? No, stop. Yes, stop trying. You monster frisbee. I press the I press the smash action to try to attack it. It's my fault. An M60, but no ammo. <laughs> Ooh, if it had ammo. Belt links, belt links. Don't I? Soon. What? Pepper, pork and beans. Such a pork and beans. Unmanageable pain. Getting something better than aspirin, man. Yeah, a real flashlight. It's probably better than a headlamp. Unload. Headlamp. Drop. Headlamp. Debate. Flashlight. Oops, I... A gun. 12-gauge Gatling gun. What the frick? <laughs> Literally driven six-barrel Gatling shotgun. Fed from handmade cloth belts and properly mounted, this seems like an unwieldy beast. And the six separate barrels make for difficult zeroing. Externally driven action means it's much less likely to jam. Jesse. You talking about? 9 by 19. It's not the same as that, though. A Gatling gun. A Glock. Now, if we unload. Actually, 9 by 10. 9 by 19 ammo is what we got. Oh, it's reloaded, so it's not quite as good, but. So activate MP3 player. Unload. MP3 player. Reload. MP3 player. Better battery. We're out of time for this video again. <laughs> I thought we were dead. We're very close, so. It's anyone's guess how much longer we'll make it. I hope you all enjoyed, though. If you did, remember to hit the like button, keep the conversation going in the comments, and subscribe if you want to see more. Remember to check out Orange01's gaming channel, too, and see his perspective on his run. Until next time, hope you have a good day.